Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Eastridge High School. I'd like to direct everyone's attention to midfield this time. Tonight, we will be honoring our seniors as they take their home pitch as they near the end of their career as a night player. It is with great pleasure that we bring to you our senior night program in honor of our senior night players. And now presenting our senior players. Our first senior is Isabella Brown. She is escorted by her parents, Danielle and Nick Brown. And Bella, as we know her, has played soccer for the Knights for three years. Bella's most memorable soccer experience, all the fun bus rides to and from the away games. When asked, what are your funniest soccer experience, Bella replied, when we were leaving for an away game, and the bus had to stop, so Juliana could go closer to the car door that was somehow left to wide open. Way to go, Juliana. When asked what she'll miss most about her teammates and her coaches, she replied, I'll miss the friendships I made and all the fun memories we shared with my teammates. I'll miss the endless encouragement from my coach and how he pushed me to be a better version of myself. When asked what family members she would like to thank, Bella stated, I'd like to thank my parents, my grandparents, and my little sister for always supporting me. Bella's future plans include continuing her, continuing her education at Lake Sumter State College and transferring to UCF to continue her goal to become a psychiatrist. Congratulations and good luck, Bella. Supported by her parents, Caroline and Christopher Davison, and her sister, Casey, Caitlin, and Victoria. Jordan has, has been playing soccer for the Knights for three years. Jordan's most memorable soccer experience, getting named varsity team captain after beating Lake Mineola in this year's preseason classic semifinals. When asked, what is your funniest soccer experience? Jordan, Jordan replied, Constant, constantly being told that my team cannot withstand the smell of my keeper gloves after every game. When the smell doesn't even bother me, or other goals. When asked what she miss most about her teammate and coaches, she replied, the family-like environment, regardless of the score of how we were played, we never stop loving and supporting each other. We fight and give each other attitude, but we fight as one, and that's what families do. And that's how this lady nights like it. When asked what family members she'd like to thank, Jordan stated, my parents were teaching me that athletics that aren't always how skillful you are, it's also how strong you are emotionally and mentally. Once you have that down, then you can be a leader on and off the field. I'd also like to thank my sisters, blood, and teammates for keeping me on my toes and having my back to do everything. Jordan's plans after graduation are to pursue a bachelor's, bachelor's degree in administration at Birmingham Southern College and to play lacrosse. Congratulations and good luck, Gordon. Our next senior is Noelle Bernhoff. She's escorted by her parents, Jenny and Shane. I'm sorry, the wrong names. <laughs> Noelle's been playing soccer for four years for East Ridge. Uh, Noelle's most memorable soccer experience, all the times riding the bus home from away games when we just won. Everyone would be so energetic and we would scream songs and laugh about anything and everything. When asked what your funniest soccer experience is, Noelle replied, when Coach stood up from the bench to pick a soccer ball, but ended up slipping on a water bottle and falling down. <laughs> Leon, I think everybody's going to remember that one for a long time. <laughs> when asked what you'll miss most about your teammates and coaches, she replied, I'll miss my teammates and how much we laughed and had fun also getting our work done. What I miss most about Coach is how we managed to make every practice fun while still helping us grow as a team and as a person. I want to thank Coach for everything he has done for us and all the time he spends with us when he can be with his family. He has helped me reach my goals, not only on the soccer field, but in the classroom as well. 
These past four years have been an amazing experience. I'm so grateful for everything Coach has done for me. Even helped me break my sister's record. Sorry, Alexa. <laughs> when asked what family members she'd like to thank, yeah. Emma stated, my mom and dad always trying their best to win my soccer games and to support me whenever they can. They've made soccer a big part of my life, and for that, I'm very thankful. <laughs> I'm not sorry. No. Emma's plans after graduation are to attend Florida Atlantic University and major in business economics. Congratulations and good luck, Noel. <laughs> On behalf of the Knights girls soccer coaching staff and the entire Knight family, we thank all of our senior players for wearing the Knights jersey with pride. We are grateful for every effort, commitment to the team, and the lessons we've learned along the way. We encourage you to continue to always do your best whenever, life, wherever life may take you. Congratulations and good luck to our 2020 seniors.